Hi! In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add, customize, and utilize drop shadows in Google Slides. Let's start by opening a new Google Slide file. Once you are on the Google Slide website, locate and click on the plus icon found at the bottom right corner. This action creates a fresh, empty presentation file. Now, for the purpose of this tutorial, let's remove any placeholder text areas and insert a vertical format image that we will apply a drop shadow effect to. To proceed, we need to find the format options. Simply right-click on the image and then click on Format Options. This action will open a new panel on the right side of the screen. In this Format Option panel, you'll find various options to work with. The option you see depend on whether you are working with an image or graphic or applying drop shadows to text in Google Slides. Then, select Drop Shadow and then explore the available options. You will notice several sliders including color, transparency, angle, distance, and blur radius. If you find this video helpful so far, please consider subscribing to help YouTube algorithm show my video to other nerds like us. While color typically remains at its default value, transparency, angle, and distance are crucial sliders as they determine the behavior of the shadow effect. It is generally recommended to work with transparency values ranging between 70 to 80 percent, unless specific project requirements dictate otherwise. Note that adjusting the angle requires moving the slider manually, which can be somewhat inconvenient. The blur radius slider controls the level of blurriness in the shadow effect, with the default value usually being adequate. By altering these values, you can achieve various shadow effects. Remember, when stacking the multiple images and applying drop shadows to each, it is essential to keep the effects subtle. Primary concern should always be legibility, especially when working with text shadows or shadow effects. That's it! Hope you learned something from this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to see more of this. See you again next time.